told me that I'm gonna be above and not beneath. He told me I'm the head and not the tail. He told me he'll make a way out of nowhere. He told me he'll never leave me nor forsake me. He told me everything that in his word said. So therefore, as long as I got his word, and the Bible says that heaven and earth will pass away before his word ever goes anywhere. So therefore, and no matter what comes in my life, I can stand on the word of God. What did he tell you? He told you be strong and of good courage. He told you his strength in your heart. He told you he'll provide your every need. He told you he'll give you your wants. He told you if you submit yourself to him, he'll make the devil flee from you. Maybe it's time to submit yourself to God. Give your life to the Lord. Let him be the ruler of your life. Notice what the Bible says. It says that when your faith is under pressure, it'll show your true colors. Where's your true colors saying? Are you like my printer in the office that's out of black ink right now? Or are you like the printer that your color is starting to fade a little bit? Or are you like that new ink that I'm getting ready to put in there? It's fresh and clean. It's crisp and ready. It's ready to tackle the assignment that is getting ready to attack. So therefore, my brothers and sisters, what are your true colors going to show? Is it going to show that when your faith is under pressure, you leave your faith in the altar? Is it going to say that when your faith is under pressure, you retreat like the old punk soldiers? Or is it going to say that you're ready for your assignment? Is it going to say that you're ready to do what God called you to do? Is it going to say, come hell or high water? I'm able to do this thing. I'm not running anymore from the enemy. I'm not bowing down to the enemy anymore. The enemy can't take my joy no more. He can't take my peace no more. I'm not giving in to what the enemy wants me to do. He wants you to run away from your situation. But it's time now that we as the people of God stand up to the devil. Oh, yes. Devil, you should have named me run when you had the chance. But because my faith is under pressure, I'm just like those diamonds. If you want a real diamond, not that little iron that you got, but a diamond, it means you gotta go through some things. It means you gotta go through the pressure. It means you gotta go through some hard times. You gotta go through the heat. You gotta go through some tough and rocky situations. But you're coming out pure. That's just like the yes. scripture says. He'll make you pure as gold. So therefore, I ain't running no more. I ain't being a track star no more. I'm turning in my metal and giving it over to the Lord. I'm standing on the promises of God that says no matter what comes in my life, I'm more than a conqueror through Jesus Christ that gives me strength. I'm better, to, I'm better today than I was on yesterday. I'm greater than my situation. I'm greater than my devil. I'm greater than my enemies. Because if God be for me, he's more than the whole world against me. And all I gotta do is begin to hit my power switch. Stop walking around with your switch off. Stop walking around unplugged from the socket and begin to plug yourself into the word. Plug yourself into the spirit of God that says that I can do all things yes. through Christ that strengthens me. I don't care what comes my way. If I'm plugged in, I'm ready to flip my switch and let the devil know that I'm anointed by the Lord God Almighty. I'm able to be a sufferer. I'm able to defeat this giant. David said it like this. I ain't coming to you in my name, but I'm coming to you in the only name that is above every name. When I come to you in my name, I can stumble and fall. But when I come to you in the name of Jesus, in that name, every knee must bow and every tongue must confess. I'm tired of my enemies standing up at me and looking me in my face. I'm ready to make that devil bow down. I'm ready to make him flee from me. So from now on, every time I see my devil, I ain't running no more. But in Jesus' name, you got to bow down. In Jesus' name, you got to flee from me. I'm tired of walking around. You ought to be tired too of being defeated in your life. Not standing up and getting all God has for you. Let the devil take away your joy. Let him take away your peace. Let him take away your happiness. This time out for that. Later for that mess. Like the video said, ain't nobody got time for that. It's time to stand up and know that God is real. And at the name of Jesus, I can defeat my battle. At the name of Jesus, I don't have to run away anymore. At the name of Jesus, I can stand the pressure cooker. Go ahead and flip the lid. Go ahead and put it on now. Set the timer for the log is setting. Because I'm going to show you what I'm made of. Come hell or high water, I'm ready to 
take my best hit. I'm ready to start swinging. I'm going to go ahead and swing. Not with my physical hands, but with the word of God that tells you that I can do what God called me to do. I can be the head. I don't have to be in lack anymore. Stop taking the back seat and start taking the front seat. God called you to be a leader, not always a follower. It's all right to follow every now and then because you can't lead if you can't follow. But now God says you've been following.